Hi, I'm Molly Gold, video blogger, and today I want to talk with you about how you can outsmart the chaos when it comes to your schedule and blog her. In just about a week, we'll all be there, and while I'm home, doing my thing in my workout gear, managing my kids, and working from home, the juggle we all face in the summer, the reality is, is it's time to get cracking and nail down my plans so that I know exactly what I'm doing so that I can have a successful event. So yesterday, Jody Grundig of Mom's Favorite Stuff tweeted, I need help getting my schedule for blog her in order. Molly? Question mark. Well, Jody, here's your answer. Number one, spend time on the blog her website and map out your sessions, map out key sponsors, and map out special events. Pick the ones that are most important to you and then lay them out by time to see where and when it might all go down. You're gonna be able to identify where things overlap and you're gonna be able to identify where you might need to cut back. And just after you make your list, go through and cut back on two of everything because you always will take in more on that list than you actually will have time to take in in real life. Then number two, wow, it's sitting over here you wanna make sure to download the app. Who better than a conference organizer to tell you exactly where you need to be and when? Blogger has created a fabulous app with a lot of features. Some of the things that I really like that it includes is a scanner so that you can scan the barcode like the one you will find on my business card if we meet. It has an attendees list. It has an opportunity for messages. It has a sponsors list and a Twitter link. But most importantly, when it comes to schedule, is it has a schedule feature. You can look up your schedule by day, by track, by speaker. But the cool thing is, if you go in by day now, long before you get there, and for each day you go through and you pick what you want to attend, see that? There's a little button to click. Then once you're on site, all you have to do after you open the schedule feature is open up favorites and it will show you only the things that you clicked. Why is this important? Because it will clear out all the clutter of everything that you've already decided. You know what? That's not important to me. It doesn't mean that you can't go back and check it out. It just means that you've already narrowed your focus only to the things that in advance you said you wanted to attend. And then number three, you want to make the use of the alarm feature on your smartphone. I have a Samsung Note. I love my Samsung Note. I use it for video. It has a a double facing camera so I can not only take video of you but I can take video of me. I use it to take really great pictures that I'm able to share on Instagram. I'm able to share all over personally and professionally. It has a fabulous size keyboard and a fabulous size screen to make things go well but it has a lot of other features just like your smartphone does too. The ability to take notes, the ability to use its own calendar feature for other events that I might be engaged in and also the ability to send messages. But what's key here is using that alarm feature on the clock. I'm gonna give myself 10 minutes before the end time of anything for my alarm to gently remind me that it's time to wind down the conversation or wrap up what I'm doing. So those are my three tips for you. And now let's talk about the smartphones. Do you have one? Because if you don't, I happen to be giving one away. Thanks to the generosity of About One, this phone is not sponsored by anybody. I happened to win it in a giveaway at Type A. My card was drawn out of a fishbowl. And guess what? Because I'm already in love with one Samsung product that is heaven in a, heaven in a mobile device, I've got an extra one to give away for you. So if you'd like to win a smartphone, to be precise, a Samsung Focus 2, to get at Blogger, leave me a comment below that tells me how you use a smartphone for your best success when you're at a conference. All the instructions about the, conf about the contest and its parameters are below. I wish you good luck and I look forward to meeting you in person when you win because I'm gonna bring it to Blogger and hand it to you directly. Thanks so much for stopping by. Make sure to share your ideas and make sure to answer the question. Good luck. And I hope my tips help you, Jody, to have a very organized schedule while you're at Blogger 2012. Take care.